Turn the fan. We out here on Lake Mirror. So today we're gonna be doing a little, little bit differently. I just got done filming Let's Fish episode two. So that'll be out Wednesday or Tuesday. Well, well I don't I can't remember. Anyway guys, today the main challenge is gonna be using light line. I got me a, a little cup of worms. We're gonna go try to find some bigger bluegill, hopefully. I don't know if we can though, but I'm gonna catch anything that bites some worm. Take a little break from bass fishing. And if y'all enjoy these types of videos, let me know down below and hit the thumbs up for me. As always, subscribe to the channel. Let's go catch some bluegill. Let's get it. We got one. <laughs> it's a little guy. It's pretty though. Right. First fish of the day. Oh, he ain't big enough to keep. Let's go find some bigger ones. I'm hoping we can find some bigger ones. Another little sunfish. We've got one on the baba. Is he going to eat it? Eat the bobber or the worm, not the bobber. <clears throat> Yay! <laughs> well, we might not be finding big fish, but it's definitely still a little bit fun. It's always fun to catch a fish. We could probably just use that little bit right there. Right on up in here. Get us another hunk. Look at that. <laughs> oh, we got him. All right. Another little guy. Well, let's try to get another one with the same piece. Let me stand up so y'all can see better. Oh, there's a bite. Hey, it's a little bigger, but still puny. <laughs> Ow. All right, that's a pretty fish. It's got like pink on him. Let's let him go. Later, dude. I got a good one that time. Oh, what is that? I think that's a bass. <laughs> Always on the toe of the motor. Oh, my Jesus, let me stand up. What do we got? I think it's a catfish. He ain't coming up like a bass would. Oh man. What the heck? Where you going, bud? Just gotta let the rod do the work. Jesus. Going back to the bank. I'm coming with you. And he's about to go back around. 
Let me get this net ready. Uh. Oh. Come on, bub. Yep, a little catfish. <laughs> oh man, fighting him on this ultralight though was fun. He straight knocked the crap out of it. He ain't done yet. This he ain't ready to be done. Yeah, he's ready now. Come on, man. Man, I ain't got a six pound test. There we go. Definitely wasn't expecting that. Sorry, dude. All right, check that out. Let's get a weight on him. 3.10 pound catfish on an ultralight reel. I'm gonna get some pictures and I'm gonna let him go. Alright, let's let him go. That was a fun fight. <clears throat> and really, all I did, I threw it right up under that dot right there. And he just thumped it. We're going to have to retie after that. And I'm going to give her another toss up under there. Oh, we got that one. That's a little better one. Yeah. That looked pretty pink one that likes to swallow the hook. Alright. We got the hook out. Let's let him go. Off he goes. So the rig I'm using is just a little cheap bobber and just a little hook with a worm on it. No weight, no nothing like that. I'm just pat, ugh, pat passing. Throwing out there beside bushes, any little lay downs. Normally they just hit it. Like I could probably sit in one spot and catch a, little, a bunch of little ones, but I'd like to find some bigger ones. I really don't know how to find the bigger ones, so if y'all know in the comments, let me know where I should be looking to find bigger spring bluegill. <clears throat> if y'all like videos like this, definitely, because it's really relaxing. Like I'm not out here bass fishing, even though this area it's just 
calling my name for a jig. So I'm just sitting here. Oh, we got a bite. Hold on. Oh, I missed him. <clears throat> but I'm just sitting here throwing my worm around that the fish just took. And there was a freaking hawk. Well, there was a squirrel in this pine tree. There's another one running right there. And wow, there's like five squirrels right there. But I heard a hawk go, Ping! you know, the little sound hawks make or whatever. And next thing I know, all these freaking squirrels just darted everywhere. They're like, oh no, yee -yee, let me get out of here. <laughs> That was nuts. Alright, you little bait stealer. Come here. Let's see if we can get this guy without cutting the camera off. Come here, little buddy. You know you want the worm in your mouth. <clears throat> Just put the boat on the trailer. I mean, we went out there and gave it a dangle. We didn't exactly catch any giant bluegill. Like, if y'all got any tips for finding bigger bluegill, let me know. Like, I mean, I could probably sit there all day and catch the little ones, I know. Which, I mean, it's still fun, still catching a fish, but I would like to find some bigger ones. I know I had a question the other day where there's some shellcracker spots. Now, I know one of them, but. I don't feel like driving that far today. So if you got any tips, let me know down below. And if you know what's good for you, hit that subscribe button for me. Until next time, guys. What the yeah!